texture board. For this project, you'll have two pieces of paper, it doesn't matter what color they are, a little bottle of glue, and some scissors. First, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take one of the papers and we're going to tear it, because this is one way that you can change the paper. So I'm just gonna tear a big strip off, like that. Now we're gonna cut paper. I decided to cut mine in like a zigzag line. So you can see I'm going to the left, to the right, to the left, to the right. So I'm gonna do that all the way until the end. And then I'm gonna do it one more time so that I have a cut edge on both sides of the paper that I'm going to make. Okay, now I'm going to take this paper and I'm going to fold it. So I'm going to push a part of it away from me and crease it down. Then I'll flip it over, push it away from me, crease it, flip it over, away from me, crease, flip, away from me. And I'm going to keep doing this until I get to the very end. Now look when I open it up, it looks like an accordion, which is a kind of musical instrument. Okay, next I'm gonna show you how to scrunch the paper. So I'm gonna rip the part off again, and then I'm gonna make it into a little smaller piece, and I'm gonna roll it up like a ball. That's scrunching. I can do this as many times as I want. Next, I'm gonna tear another strip off, and this time I'm gonna show you how to curl the paper. So I'm gonna take a pencil, and I'm gonna put it on the very edge of the paper, and I'm gonna hold it down very tightly, and I'm gonna keep rolling it. It reminds me of when I have to roll a sleeping bag up. So I'm holding on tightly, and I'm rolling and rolling and rolling till I get to the very end. And I'm trying to keep it tight. Then when you're done, you're gonna kind of squish it down with your fingers, kind of rub it, and then pull the pencil out. And then you can actually uncurl it a little bit like that. And it looks so cool, all curled up. Okay, so I've shown you tearing, cutting, scrunching, curling. Now I'm gonna show you twisting. So I have one more strip. I'm gonna open up my glue bottle. I'm gonna put a couple drops of glue at the end of the paper. And I'm gonna glue this part down to my other paper. And this is where I'm gonna put all the other papers that I just made in just a little bit. So I've gotta hold this for a little bit because it. I'm, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna twist it. Do you see how I twisted the paper? Kind of looks like a roller coaster. And once that one side is staying down, then I can pick up the other side and I can glue that one down. Sometimes you have to hold these for quite a while before they wanna stay. Now I'm gluing all of those texture pieces down to my big paper and so I'm just putting glue and adding them on and these are all the ways to create texture for your texture board. 
These are examples that are at school on the wall behind the art room door. And they're ones that kids have made uh, last year. And they just look so beautiful all together. And you can see folding and cutting and scrunching and rolling all right there. Now create your own texture board. 